I should check the mail. Oh, dang, I forgot my key. I'm just gonna make a note of that. Key for mail. I would mark its location on the map, but I've already marked something else. So I'm gonna say... To, uh, I'm gonna write later. To, down, from, mark. There we go. Two rooms down from my current mark. Well, in that case, I guess I'll just explore this room from the original door I came into. Appears to be. Never mind, it's not safe. Okay, there's another one. You're not just like going in a circle, are you? I think it is. I don't think I read the last note. Yeah, I didn't. I read this one, right? Yeah, the weird one about baseballs. I was just trying to help. I thought I could help. I could see him give up, and then he shattered before my eyes. I'll sleep in one place and wake up in another. Thinking about these minor mysteries keeps my mind from shutting down. Or am I causing this for myself? Am I here because I'm a coward? Green tea. All right, I've got a really good stockpile of stuff. Son of a bitch. All right, so this is a new place. No, it's not. Or wait. Yes, it is. Oh! Fuck, I just made a new mark, didn't I? I did. Oh, well. Alright, that's obviously blocked. There's a monster behind that door, so let's go through this door. But I just went in here, didn't I? Yeah, I think I've fully explored it at this point. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm just going in circles. I need to start deleting items from my inventory at this rate. I got one slot. Hi there. Let's 
screw you. I think I need to go down here. Yeah, it looks like this is the only doorway back here. This one? Yeah, there we go. This is the new spot. Okay. Alright, hold on one second. I'll be right back. Alright, I am back, and, um... I had a little bit of an adventure while I was away, because right after I, uh... took my break, I realized, oh, I should probably pause the game, so I tried to do that. And as it turns out, the, the menu has now decided it wants to break. I, I press the button, and it just instantly disappears. So, I couldn't pause it, so I kind of ran somewhere else. I was thinking if I stayed here, my sanity might get too low. It actually seems like it's fine. But I tried running somewhere else, and I ended up just, like, running across a bunch of enemies and on some massive chase, and I got hit, like, three times. So, I had to drink another one of my Happy Sun Extremes! So, yeah, that happened. Anyway, I made my way back here, obviously. Everything's fine, so I got plenty of stuff. Hi! That's a lot of beer. Looks like he ate everything, including some of the cardboard. What have you been up to? Uh, why is there like no ground here? Holy shit, it's a huge hole. Oh my god, his name is... Bro. <laughs> What's up, gorgeous? Uh, hi. Hey, bro, do yourself a favor and don't go into that room. Okay. Why? Oh man, it was totally epic. I was like, barfing up crap I ate like four days ago. The hurling was so violent I knocked down a wall. Yeah? What? I was speechless too. And I did this kind of stuff, and I do this kind of stuff all the time. You're proud. I know, right? It was pretty freaking awesome. It's like initiation. I've got to show them I'm a badass to get in. And I'm like the baddest ass you'll ever see, bro. Is. Is. Is the water coming from the hole? Water? Whoa, are you wasted too? Smart plan to drink water with every drink. I'm obviously dealing with a professional. What? You you know what will get to your head, right? What is that? What the f Who is this person and that doesn't make any sense and what the fuck is happening? Why am I speaking to a man named Bro? The nastiest, greasiest, absorbiest food we can find. I was out looking for food. Alright, I'm done with this. I was out looking for food because I was totally wasted too. But I don't really remember why I came in here. Um, I just need some rest. Nah, bro, we need snacks. Trust me, I do this kind of thing all the time. I have some puffs and it's in there. Okay, so he wants puffs. Just whatever it takes to make you stop talking to me because I fucking hate you. Bro. You do not want to go in that bathroom, bro. Actually, I kind of do. Something heavy is pressing against the door. Okay. Alright, so that's blocked. <clears throat> what about what's over here? Unicorn posters? Must be a corny. <laughs> a corny. Non-copyright infringing.
Okay, well... Alright, even though there's a wall listed on the map, I can just walk right through it because everything is, like, broken and stuff. Wait, haven't I been in here? Actually, no, I don't think I have been. Where does that go? Oh, wait, what? I'm here on the map and I go to the... To, uh, to whatever, I don't understand the map. Cheese puffs! Tastes the same as the box holding it. Sounds about right. Alright, bro, I got your puffs, brah. Here's your food. Oh, ho, ho, you rock, boss. God, I'm starving. Can I ask you a question? Fire away. Why'd you come here to eat your food? I just needed a break from the frat. This place had some empty spots. You don't like it there? No. And don't you tell anyone I said that. You can trust me. Being a bro is what everyone else is or wants to be, but it's not who I am. Aww. He's a fake bro. A fro. It's okay, fro. It's okay. I don't know who I am. <laughs> Alright, this bro fro is having an existential crisis. The alcohol, well, that just helps me get into character. Besides, the parties aren't so bad once you knock a few back. I just do six or seven shots and wait for the alcohol to do its thing. That's sad. Yeah, it is. I just want to fit in somewhere. Anywhere. You sure you're alright? No. I need an answer. What's the question? Did I or didn't I? What did you do? I don't know. Hmm... Well, I'm not so good at these kinds of logic problems. Thanks for getting my puffs. Talking to you, I don't know. I just feel better knowing that not everybody's got it figured out. Hmm. Well, that turned from obnoxious bro into, uh... A fro, and then a commentary, I suppose, on how people try to fit in. It took a nice turn. It's getting deeper. Small radio, whoa. Still seems to work. Okay, can I use it? I guess I probably have to give it to someone.
Can I do something with this box? Something I can reach? Doesn't seem so. I need a key, I should check the front office. Ah, that's where that puzzle is, isn't it? In fact, I need to go do that right now. I don't think I can continue unless I get the key. Okay, what's in here? Oh, right. Here's the mailbox where I need the key to get into it. Okay. Um, this way? Yes. Okay. Um Yeah, I'm going to work on this. There we go. Got it. Yeah, that one was really simple. I just looked up the the five stages of like loss and grief and just did them in the correct order. Correct order is denial, anger, bargaining, depression, and then acceptance. Hosting key. There we go. Used my host key. Well, technically it's not a host key, it's a hosting key, but, uh, close enough. Where's it coming from? What the hell? Oh god. Oh, I can't make it past, can it? Alright, what am I doing here? Find the- oh, what was that? Oh, shit. Shit. Come on, come on. Wait, what? So it, it just magically finds a way over that obstacle? Or, it- what? It kind of comes and then it doesn't? I don't get it. Is it blocked with his obstacles or not? I can't tell. Right, anyway. Let's go this way. I can't open it with all this water. Oh god, great, I gotta go the other way. Or maybe not. Alright, secret place. I'm not even on the map anymore. Oh, hi! Found a note. God, I'm almost drowning it so high. Oh, shit! Oh, 
Am I going up the water? Where am I? Not even on the map. Alright, let's take this brief time to read the note that says help. Everything is barren, flat and dry. Cloudy skies swirling overhead. I'm surrounded by thousands of roaming people who are the perfect reflection of this place. No one looks at each other. No one talks to each other. Should I help them? Will they help me? Does it matter? Looks like the water is becoming more and more foul the closer I get to the source. Okay, mental health is not too good. Let's keep the flashlight out. What the fuck? Where the hell are you two going? I told you, I'm taking Claire to the carnival. You didn't think to ask me if I wanted to go? Don't start this crap again. Not in front of Claire. You're either out drinking or you're spending time with Claire. This is her fault. Leave her out of this. It was your fault. Guilty. Guilty. Guilt. No. No. Bullshit. Claire, we didn't have to take you in, but we did. Everyone was happier without you. I can't take care of your mother anymore. You need to start pulling your weight around here. You owe it to her. You weren't wanted. Mistake. Burden. You spent your whole life looking for answers. Mom, who's the boy in the picture? Dad, Mom, Claire, Ethan. Only to reject them when you learn the truth. Mom, what happened to Ethan? What did you do? No. What did you do, Claire? Stop! No, no. I can't take this. I can't... What happened, Claire? Claire. No! What are you doing to Claire? Where's Ethan? Come on, Claire. Come back to me. Come on, Claire. Come back to us. Get away from her. Jesus. High-end apartment bathroom. There's nothing out there. I see nothing. There is a current, a flow of people. I don't know where they're going, but anything is better than here. A rich young man's story, repenting for his misdoings.
Here we go. Haven't been here. I don't feel well. Oh god. I'm gonna have to go in there anyway. Wait, where'd I just go? Oh, it's a vent. Where does that take me? Just to the other side. Another lockpick. Oh god, I don't have any room. Where are all of these locked doors that I seem to be missing? Because I've got so many lockpicks. These trash bags are levitating. Crap. Oh, that's a new area, actually. Shit. He might come after me. Yep, yep, it's coming. In fact, that one's probably gonna come too. I don't feel well, I need to go home. I would love to. Okay, come on, come on. Come on, you son of a bitch. Okay. Oh, no, it's still coming. Great. What the fuck? I feel sick to my stu- Yeah, alright. Jesus, I don't want to be here. Can't sprint. Now I can sprint. Oh, it's gonna know I'm there. Fuck. No, get out. Jesus. Stop following me, you piece of shit. Okay, finally stopped. I need to go home. Yes, I do. Um, hell is actually fair. I'll take one anyway. Yeah. That's fine. Okay, where am I? <laughs> Why does it make a door sound? I'm just hiding behind a box. Jesus, this place is getting more and more messed up. What in the hell? I can go and go through the upside down door? Is it gonna chase me through the upside down door? Of course it will. Is it in here? Yes, it is. Let's see if it can make its way up here. It doesn't even care about the floor. Why would it? The floor is beneath it. Oh, 
Okay, Jesus. The familiar smells. Hold on, there's actually something to the left. I think there's a monster to the left as well. Or maybe not. That's where I came from, right? Yeah. Yeah, I want that. Oh, warm coffee. I just bumped it with my head. Perfect. I think I'm probably just going to destroy one of these bent paper clips. Unless I come across like a huge amount of locked doors. All at the same time. What the fuck? Butterfly. Where the hell am I now? Alright, so you can't get in here through the normal doors. But I can take the secret entrances. Or maybe not? That's unblocked? I thought it was blocked. It's, it's still marked as blocked, but it works. Oh, Jesus. She... She's not dead? Apparently not. Well, that's a good thing. Um, hi. I said leave. I... Leave! This looks familiar. Familiar? What's wrong? You wouldn't understand. I bet you would. I bet I would. <clears throat> I bet I would. Oh, really? You know what it's like to see your family destroyed? You know what it's like to feel alone and isolated all the time? You know what it's like to be hopeless and pathetic? Yeah, you do. I do. Tell her your name. Then maybe she'll give you hers. My name is Claire. What's yours? Jean. Good. That's a start. Why do you feel alone? B because I am. My mom died a few years ago. After that, my boyfriend moved us out here. Away from everyone I knew. After... something. He became distant. We don't talk anymore. No one gets how I feel, so no one wants to be my friend. I'm alone. Tell her about your family. I've lost my family. I know how you feel. I'm sorry. I... Don't know what else to say. It's okay. You don't have to say anything else. But, if it's all the same, I would like some privacy. You can't leave her. She needs you, Claire. Is this gonna be like the guy, the teacher, where it's like, uh, there's one option and then one good option and then the rest result in her dying or something horrible? Or turning into a monster? Um. I. I don't really want to say the first one. Either of the either of the other two ones seem okay. I'll be your friend. Well, I'm probably not going to be around long enough, but, uh, maybe? It's either number two or number three. Hmm. Uh... 
I know your pain. It actually worked. Excellent. Understanding for the win. How the hell did I get in here again? Was it this? Was it this way? No. Or wait, was it? Oh yeah, it was. Let's go save it first. A note. Why is there blood in my save room? I don't like that. Claire. No, I have to see my family again. I'm breaking away from the current. There's a faint white light in the distance. I'm gonna run towards it. sights. Uh, sure. Yeah, I was about to say, my sanity's not doing so good. I should choose a way and go through it. Crap. Let's try this way. Hold on, there's something... There's something behind this. There we go. Happy Sun Extreme. Okay, let's get my sanity back. It's writhing. Wait, I just went here, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Is there someone under the covers of that bed? That forgotten feeling of security. Is this what home is to you? Uh, I need to rotate a certain way? I have no idea. I was trying to see if it was affecting that heartbeat sound that I'm hearing, but I don't think it is. Yeah, 
aim the model up. That didn't work. I have no idea. Point, uh, point. Yes, point. Point towards each other is what I meant to say. I have no idea. Okay, well, I guess I will mark this. If I don't solve it right now, I'm going to have a hell of a hard time getting back here, though. These don't indicate a direction of any kind. Am I supposed to have all the information I need back there, or do I need information from somewhere else? That is the million dollar question. I just don't know. If I'm supposed to have the information here, what here could tell me where to aim it? I don't even know this is what this is going to do. I have no idea. Okay, where have I not been? What the hell? What is that? Oh god, uh, shit. Coffee. Okay, where it looks like some sort of sigil. Okay. Not sure how that helps me whatsoever. Is that the wheel? It doesn't look like a wheel. It doesn't really have a notch. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Lock the door. Oh, it's, it's locked. Oh, okay, somehow. Shit. Problem is, navigating around here, nothing's marked with any sim uh, door symbols anymore because they're not doors, they're just like meat holes. <laughs> that sounds nasty. But it's true, they're meat holes. Exactly what they are. Meaning, I don't know if there's areas I haven't gone to yet. For all I know, I've explored everything. It's a little bit hard to tell. <laughs> Wonderful. Well, I'm gonna die. Yeah, I've been in here, haven't I? I have. 
take me right back here. Wait, did I just go through the- oh no, I didn't go through the locked door. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going in a circle. back here. Get out of the sigil room. Oh, screw it. Hey, at least the menu works now. Okay, I'm gonna try to figure out that puzzle and I'll be right back. There we go. I didn't figure it out on my own. I looked at uh, the puzzle guide for this uh, for this game on Steam. And in fact, the person who wrote the puzzle guide actually said that they have no idea how you're supposed to solve it, and they just used trial and error. I have no idea. Anyway. I found heart in a jar. Oh, my favorite. Is it pickled? Mmm. A still beating heart in a jar. Alright, that'll. I think that takes me through the sigil, probably, so let's go there. Not sure why the closet was making an opening and closing noise before I actually went into the closet. Is there someone in here with me? just lovely. I'll be right back. Okay, let's try that again. Uh, apparently, let's not. Alrighty, here we go again. This is what they call trial and error. Let's try that again. I've got full health, by the way. 100% full health, so... getting hit, is there?
Burn it with light. Come on. This section is really weird. Not in a good way. I'm guessing I need to keep hitting it with the light until it dies. In fact, I'm just going to restart this section. I can probably do it, but uh, now that I know I can continue to the right to use those uh, hiding spots, I don't really want to waste all of my consumables. Because I might need them for a similar section later on or something. I don't know. Not worth the risk. Come on. Maybe I don't kill it. Maybe I just keep going. I do need to restore my sanity, though. Well, that's not good. Mom, I'm home. You locked it from the inside. Oh god. Oh. I'm home. Hi, honey. How was your day? It was fine. I just got home from running errands with the kids. No, Claire. Lies. 
that dances tonight. Okay, have fun. I'm taking Ethan to the movies. Stop lying to yourself, Claire. Get the light. Oh, he's drunk, isn't he? Daddy, you're home. <laughs> but only the lamp is on? I, I, sorry, I don't think I can do a drunk voice. Turn them off. Daddy, are you alright? Jesus, Claire. Not so loud. Is there anything I can do? Just, just let me sleep. Daddy needs sleep. Daddy, you shouldn't sleep on the couch. Nah, I'm gonna sleep on the couch. Can't deal with your mom. I need it away. You understand. Uh, okay. Mom, what did you do to my butterflies? Mom, you're not eating enough. I know this hospital food sucks, but it's good for you. Mm. Don't be like that. Claire, I know you feel guilty when you're not here, but please, we're worried about you. I'm all she has. Mom? I need to hear your voice. Mommy, look at the butterflies. Their wings are beautiful. I'm gonna catch them. Good job, honey. I can't wait to show Daddy. Mom? Mom! You drowned him. You drowned Ethan. You let me suffer this entire time. I took care of you. Learning the truth was a catalyst that led us here. Now there are people trying to save you. And if they succeed, they're going to want answers. So, what's your story? What's your truth? I... I felt betrayed. I felt lost. I felt worthless. I felt alone. Anything was better than that. Do you even deserve to be saved? I don't know. It's your decision, Claire. I don't feel like it is. It was your decision to help or not help the other lost souls you came across. It was your decision to save or not save them. Now it's time to decide if you deserve the same. I... Please, wake up. You can do it, you just need to wake up. Please, Claire. Focus. Wake up. Doctor. Doctor. She's awake. She's awake. A Annie? Don't try to move just yet. Annie. You've been asleep for a while. You lost a lot of blood. How do you feel? Tired. Very tired. He hasn't left your side. We don't normally let dogs in here, but he bursted in one day and wouldn't leave. Thank you, Annie. Oh, these flowers came for you a couple of days ago. Who are they from? We had a long-term coma patient here about... about your age. He came out of it a few days ago. He'll be glad to see you're awake. Are you gonna be alright? I will be, yeah. We'll take good care of you, Claire. 
We'll get you the help you need. You're not alone in this anymore. That felt like a sudden ending. Could have done with at least a fade out or something, jeez! <laughs> Alright, post-game stretch. Uh, let's see what we got here. You know, it feels inappropriate that I'm literally looking at a scorecard. <laughs> my scorecard for my life is, you get an A for Awake! Congratulations! My score for my soul is 115. What? I, I don't even know what that means. You've quantified my soul. You've literally quantified my soul. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay. <laughs> for a second I thought that said uh, six minutes, eight seconds. I'm like, what? That's gotta be six hours, right? Yeah, that's gotta be six hours. Well, apparently I got triple A. Is that good? It's obviously not bad. And yeah, I actually heard that there is a New Game Plus, as you can see here. You can actually do New Game Plus, which seems wildly inappropriate. For a game that's all... You know, for a game of uh, this sort that's about someone... Well, dealing with the shit that she's dealing with. And about such serious topics. More narratively driven story. It's very strange that there's a New Game Plus. Hmm. Well, there we go. I think I'm going to save my extended thoughts for a video after this one that I'm going to make about it to review. But... In the meantime, I just want to say I quite enjoyed it. There's certainly some things about it that are strange. Navigation is annoying. And then there's some weird stuff like the scorecard and things like that that really take me out of the experience a bit. But uh, overall, I really enjoyed it. So, I hope you did as well. And thank you for watching.